All right, we're about to begin Objective 3.01, which is explore multimedia systems, elements, and presentations. To get started with this, uh, we're going to do some PowerPoint training. And um, PowerPoint is not the only multimedia system that we're going to explore, but it's a good start. <clears throat> the first thing I'm going to do is show you how to do um, the training part. So what you need to do is go to the SAM website by clicking on the link. You'll, um, if you wanted to go there, you can type it in anywhere. It's uh, SAM2010.course.com, and it's going to take you here. Your username is going to be your email, and then your uh, password is going to be uh, your NCWISE number for now. So go ahead and type in your username and the password. I've, for most of you, I've already set this up uh, by importing you into my section. All right, so I've typed in my information. I'm going to click on login. This is the screen you're going to see in um, if first or second or third or fourth period. I'll just experiment with first right now. The assignments will be in... Um, order according to type of exams at first. Uh, you have exams, trainings, and projects. The order we do them, we do trainings, and then we do exams, and then you do projects. I actually have it numbered here. It's also numbered in um, the order I want you to do them. There's nothing to submit here. This is just where I'll key in your grades to go into your grade book. So let's look at the first training. Click on the training. It's going to ask you to read each task. Um, you'll need headphones for this. Um, are you ready? And you click OK. And this is a simple, very process, simple process. They have, you'll see you have, you have 23 questions. It's going to, you have to read the screen. Um, it talks about PowerPoint 2010. We might be doing PowerPoint 2013 in the future. You click on Continue. And the lady will read exactly what she wants you to do. This is called the observe mode. And you basically just watch what she does for 23 steps. Then you click on practice. The practice mode, she will show you how to do it, then you do it. It will stay here until you actually click on the start button. So then you click on Microsoft Office. And this continues to go through. And then once you go through the practice part, you'll do apply. On apply, it's basically going to give you the instructions. And you can move this out of the way by clicking and dragging. But it tells you to click the start button. Go to all programs, and it'll tell you if you're incorrect. So I didn't click on all programs, so I can go back again. So, and then I click on PowerPoint 2010. It says on the start menu, point all programs, and I have completed that first task. So then I do task complete. Now I'm on question two. That means I got question one right. And I'll continue to go all the way through this. And um, I'll just keep going through. And when you get finished, when you get finished applying everything, it tells you how many numbers you completed. And then you'll be able to see your results. So I can go to training. Um, make sure you have your pop-ups turned off. And you'll see that I started the training. I made, I made a four because I only did a portion of it. I didn't do the whole thing. 
but that's all you have to do for the training part and I'll go in and I'll enter your um, your grades after you get finished it's pretty easy to do all you have to do is um, follow the steps and the training parts the easiest part of it